Wow. 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 Check it. A1, I ain't talking steak sauce. Run this now and I'm a great boss. Run this it ain't for the weight loss. Matter of fact, I'm trying to be the cake boss. Fill up the bag. To the brim right there. Let me try make a dim right there. Gospel truth, yeah, that's him right there. That boy stay by the rim right there. Step my dough just like a speed low. Tell the Uber pick me up on Pico. MLB's coverage of baseball on the show brings us to the home of the Braves, Truist Park. It's the home opener of this new season between the Chicago White Sox and the Atlanta Braves. We've got baseball on the show, and it's coming up next. Stepping up is Tim Anderson. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. Now the first pitch. And the first pitch of the game is taken for ball one as we're underway tonight from Truist Park. Now a flare out toward right center. Albies onto the grass. He's there and records the first down. So bases are empty with one out now. And that'll bring up the former top prospect as a minor leaguer, Yohan Moncada. First pitch on the way. Strike swinging, timing a little off on that one. Game time temperature here in even 60 degrees. Swing and a miss as he pulls the top hand over. It's 0-2. Nothing in two count and the pitch. And they'll try to bounce a curveball on 0 2, but he holds back. It's 1 and 2 now. Hey, the fish ain't biting there on that 0 2 breaking ball, but you got to be careful because this pitcher might throw him another one. And he fouls this one off. Here he comes again, 1 2. That's a ball. 2 2. You can bet these hitters are taking note of what the guy on the hill is working with. A long at bat like this in the first inning can reveal a lot. And he lays off here, ball four, and he'll become the game's first base runner here with one away. The left fielder. Now with the plate oh is Emo Jimenez. Jimenez. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. And ooh, I'm not sure you can get fooled worse than that. It's 0-1. Swing and a miss, and he's in the hole 0 2 now. Oh, a tough pitch to lay off that time, but he got away with it 1 and 2. You know he's probably cheating on that inside pitch after he got jammed earlier. If you're on the mound right now, you want to try to hit that outside corner, and there's a pretty good chance you'll get him to roll over something. Tough pitch to lay off there, but he did, and it's even up at two and two. Boy, that's a tough pitch to lay off right there, just out of the strike zone. But listen, when you're a 300 hitter, you don't chase a lot of those so called pitchers' pitches. This guy knows the strike zone. Here's another 2 2. Looked like the sinker there dipped a little below the knees. Not a bad time right here to put that runner in motion. 3 2 count. You send the runner, and if it's a bad pitch, it's ball four. And he misses again here. It's ball four. That and that's cool. back to back the walks catcher. here with one away. Wrong. Wrong he comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Yosmani Grandal comes on with one away as he looks at a ball. It's 1 0. Oh. Don't be shocked if he doesn't go right back to that splitter again. He's looking for a double play. And that pitch certainly has enough depth on it to get him a ground ball. There's a strike. It's two and one. Over at the knees, and that's the second strike. Well, he snapped that breaking ball off really nice. He'll do well to keep putting it there. Swing and a miss on the breaking pitch. Two away. So next to hit is Jose Abreu. Great the chance to drive and run okay. here in the early going. Good lead there at second. Here's the pitch. And it's fouled away. 23 pitches already here in the first inning. Fouled away. Now a 58 foot curveball that misses for a ball. Oh. 
And he won't go after the cut fastball two and two. Now two and two. This is the pitch where you want to attack the zone. If you go three and two, then you put the runners in motion. And he takes ball three, so it's a full count now. Fouled off. Moncada over at second. Jimenez at first, two out in the inning. Full count still. This pitch is popped up. And he will indeed make the play in foul territory to retire the side. Ready now is Ronald Acuna. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. For the break, the center fielder, Ronald Acuna Jr. Now the pitch. Check swing here, but did he hold up in time? No, he went around, says Earl Hendricks. It's strike one. The wind up and the 0 1. Hit in the air out to left field. There to make the catch is Jimenez, and there's one away. So one out, that nobody exactly. aboard, and the that'll bring up the exciting Ozzy Albies. Albies. He's ready. Here's the first pitch. And that misses for ball one. One out, nobody on. Checks his swing here, but he does so in time. Even though he was fooled in the box right there by that pitch, he was able to keep his hands back, not overcommit, and stay in this at bat. And he'll try to check his swing here, but he'll have no such luck. It's strike one. Drive and that's a base hit into center field. He takes the turn and heads for second. And he'll reach second now with one away. That is good. The dedicated hitter. Up there. Riley. Into the box now, Austin Riley. And he fouls this one off. Riley brings a ton of pop to the plate with him, particularly against right handed pitching. Some guys don't drive the ball as well when facing a pitcher who throws from the same side that they swing the bat, but that's certainly not the case here. Yeah, this guy just absolutely hammers right handed pitching. You know, some guys like the ball in, coming towards them, and that's exactly what the righty on righty matchup presents itself. A two seamer in, a four seamer that leaks out over the plate, a hanging breaking ball. This guy seems to absolutely hammer those. And a half hearted attempt that time, but they'll say he broke cool. the plane, and the that's out baseball. number two. Ready. Three man. He set now the pitch. Swing and a line drive. But this gets foul. It's 0 and 1. Runner in scoring position at second with two down. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Hey, this pitcher better be careful right here. My man at the plate is not trying to push something to the opposite field. Rounded up the first baseline, but a foul ball, and the count holds it 0 2. Hey, he finds himself down 0 2 with the quickness. I know he's a great two strike hitter, but this at bat, he's going to have to find a way to nickel and dime. And the throw is in time to get him to retire the side. Second inning set to go, and that'll bring Maybe up the outfielder, the Luis Robert. The center fielder. First Luis. offering on its way. Robert. Hit back toward the mound. And a base hit as the White Sox pick up their first knock of the ball game. That is set. The designated hitter. Clint. To the plate now, Clint Frazier, as the first pitch to him is swung on and missed for strike one. Hit out towards second. Albies picks it up. One there. Now over to Freddie, and it's a double play. So base is empty now after the double play. And that'll bring in the second baseman, Rupnit Odor. 
as the first pitch to him is taken low and away for ball one. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. A dive, but it's off his glove. And safe, says the first base umpire, as the throw was too late. At the plate, Adam Engel. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. Here comes the 0 1. Odor leads off first with a pair of outs in the inning. High in the air and drifting out to shallow center. Swanson onto the grass. He gets there to make the catch, and that ends the inning. Now at the plate, Adam Duvall, as they'll have five, six, and seven here to start the home half of the second. fielder, Adam. First offering. And there's a swing and a miss at an off speed pitch to start him out. Nothing in one. That was a great hack right there. Timing was on point. Just sometimes you have bad bat barrel accuracy. Count now a ball and a strike. The 1 1 home. Is swung on and missed for strike number two. Yeah, guys, he's got so much respect for this guy's fastball, you can tell he was out in front on that slider. I think he goes to the well one more time with that pitch. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. That'll bring up Bobby that Dahlbeck. The third baseman. Bobby. Dahlbeck. First pitch on its way. Now a swing and a miss. Took something off that one, and it's strike one. I can't speak from experience, but that's got to feel good right there. Throwing a nasty changeup first pitch and getting a swing and a miss on it. Now he pretty much opened up any pitch in his arsenal. On its way, the 0 2 pitch. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time, out number two. That brings up that Alex Kirilov. Two outs right already field. on the K this Alex. inning, so he'll be looking to do better. First pitch of the AB now. Not even close on that swing. No balls and a strike. Takes a pitch high and away for ball one. Bottom of the second here with no score. And it's fouled away. Well off the plate with the change of pace. That's ball two. And a check swing here, but he holds up far too late as it's strike three, and the inning is over. Top of the third set to get underway, and up next it'll be Leading Tim Anderson. Wheels and deals. Here's the first pitch. And he's way off balance with the swing there. Grounded to first. Freeman's got it. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Next to bat will be the Cuban import, Yon Moncada. Worked a walk in his first plate appearance. Cut fastball in there for a called strike. I love everything this pitcher's got working right now. He's got presence. He's got great body language on the mound. He's got fastball command and a nice early feel for his off speed stuff. And he'll put it away now without much of a problem. Two gone now here in the third. Base is empty, two away. And up next, the exciting Eloy, Eloy Jimenez. He's ready. Here's the first pitch. Good off speed pitch. Had him out in front for strike one. And one and one as this one's in on the hands. Here it comes. Nope. 
We just saw a fastball right there. I would not be shocked if he tries to get this guy to go fishing right here and drops a little off speed pitch in the dirt. And good patience to hold back on the curveball in the dirt. It's full now, three and two. It's a fine line from working down in the zone on two and two and bouncing one in there that basically stands no chance at getting swung at. Right there, he basically spiked that one right into the dirt, and now he has to find the zone on a 3 2 pitch. First offering on its way. Jimenez is off of first with two away. Swing and a drive to right. There it goes. And it's gone. Now back. So here's Jose Abreu. Jose Abreu. Fouled away. He popped out in his first trip. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. Hit back toward the mound. And that finds its way through for a base hit. The batter will be Luis Robert as he'll get caught chasing a bad one there at strike one. A base hit in his first trip. And it's quickly 0 and 2. A runner on first with two away. And he missed with it. It's 1 and 2. And here's one that barely misses off the inside corner two and two. Hoping to send him packing pitch on its way. Throws him for strike three and that retires the side. Ready to go for the last half of the inning, and next will be the power Wait hitting up. catcher, Max Stassi. Hey, Maddie, they need to get some offense going in this one. Getting a run back in this inning, give them a little bit of confidence that they can keep up in this game. This he'll lay off a curveball in the dirt for ball one. Now a half swing here as he wanted to pull it back, but he does so too late. It's strike one. Shot to third and handled for the first out. Digging in Batting next, nuts. Dansby Swanson. Shortstop. Dansby. Swanson. Here's the first pitch. Hit in the air down the right field line. But this is going to wind up a foul ball. Hey, when you're featuring a mid 90s fastball like this pitcher, Attack with that pitch. Get ahead. Get the offense on their toes. That opens up. Swing. High drive. Left field and deep. Jimenez is back to the warning track and he's able to put it away for the second out. Into the box. That's Ronald that's Acuna that's flew that's out that's last time up. Ronald. Almost, Matty. Almost went deep his last AB. Certainly just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard this AB. Hey, make no mistake about it. This lineup's going to have to get going and get a little bit more aggressive. This guy's pounding the zone. And that is in there for a two-out base knock. So some two-out success, and the bottom of the third frame will continue. The batter, number one, second baseman, Ozzy Albi. And that'll bring in the former top prospect, Ozzy Albies. Pitch outside the throw, and it skips in as he steals the bag easily. Now the 1 0. Now you can see he's working around this guy right here. Why not? First base is open. Walk wouldn't be the worst thing in this spot. Fouled off. That's lifted the other way out to left. Waiting on it is Jimenez, and that will end the inning. And 
And stepping in, Clint Frazier. Leading off for the White Sox. The Here's the first pitch to him. Clint Frazier. As he lays off a fastball too low for ball one. That evens it up one and one. Fouled off again, and now he's in a one and two hole. Another one sent foul. And this is swung on and missed, and this fourth inning will start the same way he ended the third with a strikeout, and there's one away. Ready to deal. Here comes the first pitch. Ruknit Odor is in with one away now as he swings and misses here at strike one. Now that's just a nasty cutter right there. I don't care if that's his cold zone and he doesn't handle that pitch in that well. Most hitters don't get to that. Hit hard on the ground to second. A dive, but he can't knock it down. It's through for a base hit. Stepping in now, Adam Engel. As he will look at a first pitch fastball for ball one. Flew out and is only at bat so far. Uh, had him lunging at that pitch away, and it's one and one now. From the stretch. Swing and a blooper down the right field line. And that'll get down for a base hit. The throw to third. And that runner will hold up at second with two aboard now. And the next to bat will be Tim Anderson. As he'll take a look at ball one. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. And he just gets a piece there as this is chopped foul. One one, and he fouls this one off. Odor on second. Engel at first. One gone. This one's blooped out toward right center field, and that's going to fall for a base hit. Tack on another here as the runner scores from second. It's a three nothing game. The bat. The third. So here's Yuan Moncada as he'll go after the first pitch to him and comes up empty at strike one. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. And he falls behind 0 and 2. Three runs, seven hits, and no errors so far for the White Sox. Ah, had him fooled as he swings through the curveball. Two down. So now to the plate, Eloy Jimenez. A couple of walks for him thus far. Eloy. Looking to minimize the damage here. Well, that sinker is normally a really important pitch for him, but it really hasn't been effective so far. It just looks kind of flat. Into the corner and slicing foul. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. Just behind the fastball there, two strikes now. Hey, this is a big pitch right here. Can't allow them to attack on any more runs. Let's see if he attacks his own or buries something in the dirt. Swing and a miss as he chases one out of the zone for the third strike, and that's the third out of the inning. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And striding forward, the designated hitter, Austin Riley. Now the first pitch. Riley. And he sends it the other way toward right center. 
Engel is there. One pitch, one out. Here's the first now baseman, back. Freddie Freeman. Freddie Freeman. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. Swing and a liner. But a foul ball here, 0 and 1. But that'll get foul. It's 0 and 2 now. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. So stepping in is Adam now Duvall. The left fielder, Adam. You ball. Outfield shaded a bit to left center, the first pitch. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. And he turns this one around high and deep to center field. A ball that's carrying. On the warning track, he makes the catch. set to get underway and that'll bring up Yasmani Grandal. The catcher. Yasmani Grandal. First pitch coming here it is. Nothing in one count here it comes. Now a splitter and he lays off a ball and a strike. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Looking to punch him out again the pitch. And the fifth inning will start with a ground out one away. So one down no one aboard and one of the more Jose. prolific RBI okay. men in the league the last few years Jose Abreu will bat next high fly ball out to straightaway center Acuna is there for it and that's the second out of the inning up next now Luis that. Robert is one for two in this one Luis. Robert. and now the first pitch. Oh, had him chopping at that one. It's nothing in one. You have to find a way to lay off that low sinker. There is just no way to do any damage. You're just looking at either a bruised shin or a ground out to the left side. Down and away, it's a ball and two strikes. Bases are empty here with two men out. And it's fouled away. Pitch popped up. Albies has got it, and the side is retired. Set now for the bottom of the fifth, and that'll bring up Bobby Dahlbeck. The third baseman, Bobby. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Right through it here, and he's behind 0-1. Big swing and a miss at the fastball, and he's behind in the count 0-2. There's another pitch for a strike, and this guy's really attacking hitters well tonight, being aggressive early on, and if he continues to throw strikes like he is, he's going to have a pretty good night. So he ran the fastball by him for the punch out. Bobby Dahlbeck is sent packing to begin the bottom of the inning. Alex Kirilov will stand in for a second time here as he swings and misses there. It's nothing in one. He comes up empty that time as he's underneath it 0 and 2. His command has been outstanding so far hitting nearly all of his spots and that's been a big factor why he's been so successful up to this point. Got him. So he's down on strikes for the second time now here Patty. tonight. Catcher. Max. Here's the Stassi. first pitch. Max Stassi shows bunt on the first pitch but he pulls it back 1 and 0. Hey, this guy's got to be pretty proud of what he's done so far. It's never easy to pitch on the road, but to have this kind of outing in a ballpark that is notoriously known as being hitter friendly, it's been a treat to watch.
skied down the left field line. Jimenez has got it and the side is retired. Striding forward now is the DH Clint Frazier. He'll try and get things started as we begin inning number six. Now time is called and this might be to buy a little time for that reliever to get loose. Shane Green takes over to start the sixth inning on the mound. Number 28. He's set. Here it comes. Set. Here comes the 1 1. I changed things up on him and he got him to swing through it. 1 and 2 now. Uh, got him on a good slider there. Swung on and missed as he's down on strikes for the second time tonight. Now batting. The Next to base. hit is Rugnet Rugnet. Odor, singled in his Odor. last at bat. First pitch of the AB on its way. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Fouled away. Bases are empty, one man out. Fouled off. Here's another 1-2. Oh, and this one is hit a ton out to center. Racing back the center fielder. And it's gone as they add still another. Standing in now, Adam Engel. And he fouls this one off. A hit in two tries for him so far. The 0 1. Hit in the air toward the gap in right center. Acuna, well, range to his left and put it away. Two down. Stepping in next, Tim Anderson. He's working on a one for three thus far. Anderson. Now here's the first offering. As he'll try to hold back on the swing, but he went around for the first strike. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. Nearly got the inside, but ruled the ball. Hit out towards second. That gets through, and he'll reach base again on his second base hit of the game. Now batting, the third baseman, Yohan. In now, Yohan Moncada. He swings and hits it foul off to the right and out of play. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. And it's fouled away. Ready on 0 and 2. Can't get him to chase. It's 1 and 2. Slider whiffed on for strike three. A great pitch to put an end to the inning. Dansby Swanson lining up to hit. Fly down in his first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. And the pitch. Swanson. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Robert is right there, one down. Oh, 
Acuna digs in now. One for two on his line so far in the game. Ronald Acuna Jr. Third baseman in tight protecting the bunt the first pitch. No runs two hits and no errors so far for Atlanta. Right over the top with that curveball and it's 0 and 2. That's an awesome 12 6 hook right there. Look at the depth spin rate nasty downward tilt on that pitch. Good job to spoil that one away and he stays alive. High and deep down the left field line. But this is just going to wind up being a foul ball. Another 0 and 2 coming. Pitch popped up, and that's going to land foul. Here's another 0 2. And there's a fastball well off the plate inside. Love the high heater right there to raise the hitter's sights. Let's see if he buries something in the dirt right here. Fouled away. Again, a 1 2. He's able to ride this one high and deep toward right center. Center fielder looking up for the track to the wall. Gone! The back, number one, second baseman. So up steps Ozzy Albies. Albies. Drilled right back up the middle. Anderson scoops it up, and that's the second out. Next will be the designated hitter, Austin Riley. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. First pitch on the way. As he'll take a look at a slider here that finds the zone for strike one. Hey, the guy on the mound is absolutely pounding the zone, and that's why he's been able to stay and pitch deep into this game. Now here's one hit in the air to the right side, and no one will get this one. Trying to send him packing for the second time. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. A.J. Minter is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 33. Seventh inning ready to roll. And up next, the exciting Eloy Jimenez. First pitch on its way. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. Obviously, the game plan wasn't to let this guy beat you right here. He's already walked twice, and that pitch out of the zone tells me they want nothing to do with him. Acuna giving chase. And he tracks it down. Nice play for the first out. Next, it'll be Yusmani Grandal. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. From the stretch. And he'll look at a fastball that doesn't miss by a whole lot. It's 1 0. Not a bad spot to miss right there. Much rather have it run inside than out over the plate where the hitter can do a lot of damage. 2 0 now. Now here it comes. Ball three. He loses him on ball four. So here's the slugging first baseman Jose Abreu now. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. From the belt the pitch. Hammered the other way to deep right field. A ball that's carrying. On the warning track, he makes the catch. So it's a runner at first with two men out, now and that brings up Luis Robert. Luis Robert. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Grounded to third. He's right there. 
And a bit of a high Lincoln. throw that time, Lincoln. but no Lincoln. problem over there Lincoln. at first as they record the out. Seventh inning stretch. Striding in is Freddie Freeman. He started out the evening 0 for 2 so far. The first baseman, Freddie Freeman. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. Swing and a miss that time. It's 0 and 1. This guy's throwing a gem so far. Biggest key 80% of his first pitches have been for strikes. Swing and a drive to right. There it goes. And out of here. And I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. Now back, left fielder. Into Adam. the box now, Adam Duvall. Duvall. As he swings and misses at a first pitch fastball, 0 and 1. He's hitless in his two at bats so far. Robert is there and he makes the catch for the out. Next the here is Bobby Dahlberg. One base. run in and Bobby. one gun so far in this inning. First pitch on the way. I tried to hold back on that pitch outside but went around for strike one. Swing and a miss, and he's in trouble now. 0 and 2. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's his wind up. I don't know if it's just flat stuff. But he's getting a lot of swings outside the zone, and he's having a big game. Grounded to short. Anderson picks it up. Throw in time at first for route number two. Next to stand in is right, Alex Kirillov. 0 for 2 for him to Alex. this point. Kirillov. Your attention, please. So with a left-handed hitter waiting, they'll go to their own left-hander out of the bullpen. Now the first pitch. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. Down the first baseline. Taken in by Abreu. The tag, and he is out. Now it'll be Clint Frazier. He'll have the first crack at it here as we start inning number eight. The designated hitter, Clint Frazier. Here it comes. Oh. One ball, no strike. The 1 0. Ball two. 2 0. Hit softly on the ground to third. Reined in. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. And out of the plate, Rutnet Odor. It's been a nice game for him. Three hits, including a homer to this point. Here's the first pitch to him. Here's the 0 and 2. Guide down the left field line. But this is going to wind up a foul ball. As we near the end of this one, it's clear the long ball has played a big role in today's outcome. Dan, D. Rowe, what are your final thoughts on what we've seen? Yeah, just non competitive pitches in some big situations, Dan, and the offense right took here. full advantage. Yeah, yeah. You know, D. Rowe, one of the things yeah. about pitching is you want to have location, and it was obvious in this one today that the pitchers weren't on point, and what happens when that happens? Hitters make you pay, and the long ball was a big part of this one here. Now a swing and a softly hit ground ball. Yeah. 
Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Got him looking, and that ends the inning. Bottom of inning number eight set to go, and the catcher Max Stassi will be the next to bat. The catcher, Max Stassi. First pitch on its way. Swung on and missed its 0 and 1. Crochet is at least partially known for his big power slider. A lot of break on that pitch, but what makes it unique is how hard he's able to throw it. Oh, got him a swing out of his shoes on that one. Nothing in two. Looks to me like he's trying to make adjustments pitch to pitch up there at the plate, but he's looked completely thrown off so far. Late on the first one, way out front on the second. The next 0 2 misses, and that'll move it to 1 and 2 now. He gets dirty, but he can't make the play. It's a base hit. The batter number seven, shortstop, Gensby. Watson. And next will be Dansby Swanson digging in as he'll go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. From the stretch. Fouled off. These are the moments that don't always show up on the highlight film right here. Big spot. They have a chance right here. This guy mixes in a knock. They have a chance to get right back in this game. If not, if he grounds into a double play, it's pretty much over. The next 0-2, and he fouls this one off. Ready with another 0-2, and a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. And here's Ronald Acuna Jr. now. Yeah, going back to that last day when he hit the home run, Matty. That ball was up and out of the zone. This guy's a real good high fastball hitter. So if I'm on the mound right now, I'm thinking I got to get that ball somewhere below the knees because this guy definitely likes that ball up and elevated. Matt Foster takes the mound now, and it appears he's being brought in to face the right-handed batter who waits next. Yeah, you usually don't hear the term righty specialist very often, but that's kind of how they're using him here, Matt. Most hitters have a harder time against pitchers of the same handedness, so we'll see if this move pans out. As with one away, he can't make contact on the first pitch. It's strike one. A ball and a strike now to the Atlanta leadoff man. Right guy, right spot. This is one of the better hitters in their lineup. Just the guy they want to see coming up now to get this inning going. And it's fouled away. Yeah, you could tell he was ready for another fastball, but the pitcher went to breaking ball, and the hitter just fouls that one off. And another foul ball. Stasi, base runner at first with one out. Here's a huge swing by Acuna and a drive to deep left. Looking up is Jimenez. That one is out of here. This game is tied. The bat, number one, second baseman. Into Ozzie. the box, Ozzy Albies. Albies. Popped him up. Anderson waits on it. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Next to hit, Austin Riley. He's hitless in three at bats to this point. He's set and the pitch. Fouled away. This is on the ground over to first. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over.
your Richard attention, Rodriguez please. will be on the mound now, to start the ninth three. inning, and his job will be keeping Number the ball game gets. tied until the bottom Richard. half. First delivery Rodriguez. to him. Takes this the other way to right on a base hit. So a great start to the ninth as the possible go ahead run is aboard to kick off the inning. Now that the third base hit. to the plate now, Yohan Moncada as the first pitch misses to him. It's ball one. Go ahead run at first, nobody out. Two balls and no strikes. The count to Yohan Moncada. Three and zero. Oh. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters. So you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. And he misses with it. Ball four. So the potential go-ahead run moves into scoring the position back. now. The left field. And oh. now Elo Jimenez. Oh. He flew out in his last AB. And on the first pitch, he grounds foul. The 0-1 fouled off. None out, runners at first and second. Protecting on 0 and 2, so we'll do it again. Ready with another two strike offering. Not a bad pitch there with two strikes, but it misses 1 and 2. Big spot right here. That's a great pitch to try and see if you could get him to fish outside the zone. He's still in the driver's seat right now, and I'd expect something else to miss off the plate. Here's the 2-2 pitch. High and deep to right center. Acuna giving chase. He makes the catch, and the runner from second will tag and hit for third. And he'll move up to third now. Runners at the corners here with one away. Now to the plate, here is Yosmani Grandal. And clearly this is a critical moment in this ball game. Go ahead, run at third with one away. No balls in one strike. The 0-1, and a good idea to hold off on that swing. It's ball one. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Everyone in the ballpark knows what the pitcher's intentions are in this situation. Great job at the plate to lay off a tough pitch in a good spot. Here's the 2-2 pitch. Well, no doubt in my mind, this has been the at bat of the night so far. And this one misses here. A close pitch on three and two, but Clyde Washington rules it ball four. The first base. So bases are loaded. Nowhere to put him with one away. And one of the more prolific RBI men in the league the last few years, Jose Abreu, will bat next. Here's the first pitch. And a called strike down in the zone, nothing in one. Hey, when a pitcher's put in a tough spot, he's usually going to go to what got him here, and that's this guy's slider. Expect to see that more often. A ball and a strike now to Jose Abreu. One and two as he chases the slider. Swing and a miss on a nasty slider right there. Always felt toughest pitch in the game. If you're a guy who like to work the big part, of the and a slider bounces, and that gets away. Good job to corral this quickly as the runners hold on. Here's one that misses inside, and the counts run full now. Three and two. For the guy on the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this A.B. hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. The next batter will be Luis Robert. He comes into this appearance in the midst of a one-for-four day. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. The catch is made deep in the alley, and here comes the runner from third. And a big RBI there as the run scores to make this a two-run game now. Up next for the right Big side. spot here. First the and second. Two men gone. Clint. And that'll bring up the outfielder, Clint Frazier. Maybe trying to back him up a bit there with the fastball. Now time is called here as we'll get a trip to the mound. Two and oh now. Got to find a way to execute either a good fastball down the way or flip something off speed for a strike. You cannot miss over the harder plate in these situations. The hitter is on high alert. 
Now the 3 0 offering. And there's ball four as this one gets away a bit. And now a crucial spot. Base is loaded. Two men gone. And that'll bring up the second baseman, Rugnit Odor. Sean Newcomb takes over now with two gone here in the top of inning number nine. Number 15, Sean Newcomb. Becomes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. And he throws the fastball by him here. 0 and 1. I kind of like the aggressive attitude right here. I know he's in a jam. What does he do? He goes to his best stuff, and that's the fastball. One ball, one strike to count. The set and the 1 1. Hold hard, but it's foul down the first base side. Ready with the 1 2. And he struck him out. So a good pitch there. And now they're going to need to string some hits together in this last at bat if they want to get back in this thing. Bottom of the inning now. And that brings in Freddie Freeman. Here we go. For the break. The first baseman, Freddie Freeman. Liam Hendricks is the man called on to close this one and earn a save in the night. First offering. And that's inside for a ball. 1 0. Two balls and a strike to Freeman. A little early, and now it's even at two and two. Now here it comes. This is hit the other way out toward left field, giving Chase to Jimenez. And he tracks it down. Nice play for the first out. The next to bat for Atlanta, Adam Duvall. He could really use a knock here, 0 for 3 in the game so far. He's set. Here it comes. Mm, clearly fooled there on the slider. Pitch up and in, keeping him honest. One and one. On that fastball is too much for him there. One and two. Oh, I think his eyes lit up when he saw that pitch coming up at his eye level. Oh, you think? If you've got a good fastball like he does, that location can be really effective. It looks so tempting to the hitter, but making contact on that pitch could be very Third tough. Baseman. Got him to go down Bobby. swinging there. Adam Duvall oh, becomes man. out number two in the bottom of the ninth. Bobby Dahlbeck is in with two away here as this one swung on and missed for the first strike. And he fouls this one off. Final strike for the Braves. And it's fouled away. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. And that'll do it here as the ball game is over. A 6-4 to four finish in tonight's affair. Chicago.